Hello, I am Federico Zofali. I lead the team at Snowflake that is responsible for building source code conversion tools to accelerate the transition to the data cloud. At Snowflake, we have used Snow Convert for over five years. Since 2020, we converted over 1.7 billion lines of code for over 45 million database objects with an average automatic conversion rate greater than 90%, which saved 40 to 70% of the equivalent manual estimated conversion effort. A critical step in every migration journey is to assess how much of your code can be migrated seamlessly to Snowflake and where the extra attention will be needed. Snow Convert provides a highly comprehensive inventory of semantic elements to help prospects and SI partners to scope the code conversion. Additionally, Snow Convert allows everyone to start converting the core of the information schema, tables, for free. Today, I will play the role of a database architect that needs to migrate out of a Teradata system using Snow Convert. By the way, Snow Convert currently supports translation from Teradata, Oracle, and SQL Server. Let me now show you a demo. The first thing we need to do is obtain the source code that we need to migrate. Snow Convert never connects to the source system. And with the Snow Convert documentation, we provide a set of instruction scripts that can be run by a DBA on Teradata to obtain all of the necessary DDL. All of the main objects are extracted, tables, views, store procedures, functions, etc. Additional code can also be provided to Snow Convert as files containing additional DML or database scripts like BTEC in the case of Teradata. Snow Convert is installed on your desktop and we provide versions for Mac, Linux, and Windows. As you can see, when we start Snow Convert, we have a couple of options. We can open a save project or create a new one or play with the provided samples projects to explore how to work with Snow Convert on sample code that is included. Today, we're just gonna play with one of the sample projects. Typically, you would need to provide the project a name, select a source, and select a, an, an input and an output path. In this case, only the output is necessary. There are some conversion settings to provide additional guidance to the migration process, but today we'll just pick the default values. In the next step is to start processing the input. There are two options, start assessments or skip assessment and go straight into conversion. Snow Convert by default can only be used in assessment mode. To enable conversion mode, you need an access code. You can work with your Snowflake team to explore options to obtain an access code. With the default mode, you can also convert all of your tables DDLs without the need to get an access code. When you do a conversion, Snow Convert will also do an assessment. But let's start an assessment. Something that is important to mention here is that Snow Convert is not a search and replace utility. It parses all of the source code, generates an in-memory symbol table, just like a compiler would do, and then it applies a set of transformation rules to convert the code to Snowflake-compatible semantics. As a last step, the translated files are generated in the output directory following the same structure as in the input directories, plus a set of assessment reports that are very useful to understand the scope of the migration and guide us to complete the job. Our typical conversion rate is in the high 90s percent. It is normal to need to manually complete the job. This is estimated to save you 40 to 70 percent of the effort compared to a manual migration. Let's take a look at the results. And when performing an assessment, Zone Convert also picks a few objects at random and show both the original and the converted side by side. We can click here on Code Compare and actually show original and converted side by side. Again, this is to illustrate the capability of Snow Convert before you obtain a conversion access code. And you can explore some of the files here. Let's go back to the assessment report. We have a lot of information in the assessment report. You can see all of the details in our free assessment training course that is actually mandatory before you can get access to Snow Convert. Today, I just want to emphasize that you'll encounter a very detailed inventory of each one of the objects that were converted, as well as which files are out of scope. The complexity of the conversions are detailed as well as the conversion rates for each type of objects. Let's take a look at some of the reports. And for instance, let's take a look at the assessment report in Word format. More detailed information about the code can be found in this report. Our goal is not only to convert everything that can be converted, but to also provide as much guidance as possible to the database architects to finish the conversion job. 
The assessment report is provided to quickly show management the details about the conversion project. It is typical that the first assessment is missing some components or databases, and these reports help at the planning stage of the project. As you can see, the report is very, very detailed. Now, let's go back to Snow Convert and continue to conversion. Since this is a sample project, no access code is necessary to continue with the conversion. If you need an access code, contact your Snowflake Professional Services representative to discuss the right support model for, for your project. So let's start the conversion. When you start the conversion, actually Snow Convert will start the process from scratch and regenerate a new, a new assessment just in case something has changed in the directories and then it will generate all of the output files. All of the files are converted and generated and in this case, the directory names represent the complexity of the source code, so you can decide what you are interested in reviewing. Again, you, you can see this, but let's look at the output, and here are objects that were created in, in the output code. The next thing that I, that I like to do to really explore the code generated by Snow Convert is to, is to open it in Visual Studio. And you can see the sample projects that was created. There is an input project, and then there is, there is, a, there is an output. And we're going to, into the conversion log and look at the output code. And you can see that there is a, the same structure of uh, folders in the input as well as in the output. Let me just show you one example here. You know, in the input, let's pick this example one cursor and say select for compare. And then we go here and we actually compare with selected. And you can see the code side by side. And, and this is going to help you a lot to determine you know, the capabilities of Snow Convert. And even when you're starting a migration, I mean, this will allow you to compare the files side by side and to see what are, what are the changes that were performed by Snow Convert in the converted code. Something that is interesting is that all of the comments are maintained in the output file. And, and we really try to just modify the code as little as possible just to make sure that all of the semantic elements of Snowflake are converted in the output code. We can go and look at other examples, but I, I will let you explore these projects at your own leisure, since they are included for the three supported platforms, Teradata, uh, SQL Server, and Oracle. And you can just convert them in the same way as I just did for you. Look at the output reports and look at the converted code and explore it side by side and see all of the changes that have happened. Head to snowflake.com to learn more about Snow Convert and get access to free table conversions and assessments. Watch training, read documentation, and even get contact info to learn more about the best practices to do a code conversion. To summarize, as a data architect, I can attest that Snow Convert is providing a highly comprehensive inventory of code that allows me to plan the migration project. The quality of the generated code reduces my manual conversion effort by more than 70%. Enjoy your conversion tasks using Snow Convert.